Oh, this is the small... This isn't what I would call the small... But... They sounded from upstairs. I should go and investigate. Okay. Back upstairs. I feel quite dumb that I didn't remember that room. The noise is caused by the frame that fell off the wall. And... This key unlocks the second hallway door. Is that this one? It is this one. Oh, nope, open. This house is massive. Battery. I knew there would be one somewhere. Maybe the opening and closing of cabinet doors is just how I deal with the 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 slight bit of anxiety that I get from playing these games. Okay, so that looped around. Do we have a light switch? No. Oh, that's no good. The chandelier fell down. What's this? Old binoculars. I remember using something similar to watch birds near the forest in my younger days. Oh, this looks like it might be the master bedroom. It's got its own bathroom. This place is a mess. Looks like the owner's left in a hurry. I wonder why. Page 7 of 20. I tried to talk to my neighbors about what I'm experiencing. But they all look at me like I was crazy. I'm starting, I'm starting to think that I'm the only one who can see it. It's a terrifying thought. It can't be killed, I've tried. Can I take the... It doesn't seem that safe to have a... A meat cleaver just, you know, chilling out. I think that that would be better in my... In my hands. 
just a suggestion. More syringes. Alright, well, it looks like we're heading downstairs. Oh. Very nice. Page 8 of 20. My wife heard strange noises in the basement. I went down to investigate, but I couldn't find anything. However, I did notice a few scratch marks on the walls of our house. They looked like they were made from something with sharp claws. Oh, hey! We made it all the way around. Can we get into here yet? Nope. So we still are trying to find access to the basement. Okay, so what have we missed? Need a key to open this box. We do not have a key. We can try find a key. Checking this. The hour hand um, of an old clock. It seems to be a grandfather clock. So there's the grandfather clock that's standing up downstairs. And then there's also the one that's lying down. Hello? Is that my wife's voice? Am I going crazy? I hope I do not turn out like my father. Okay, so... What else have we achieved with this? I thought it was going to be like the secret thing that unlocked the door, um, but it's not. We still can't get through there. I've already looked in there.
It'd be great if we could turn this off. Let's find a way to unplug it. Oh, VHS. Title Into the Unknown. A travelogue about a team of adventurers who venture into a forest to find the harbing harbinger of doom. Uh, Mothman's Lair, a documentary exploring the origins and folklore surrounding the legendary creature. And Mothman Chronicles, a collection of eyewitness accounts and interviews with people who have encountered the mysterious entity. made a noise, I did something. I don't know what that something was. I know I didn't open all of those. Oh, there's cupboards here as well. Can we open those ones? No? I'm just trying to check we haven't missed something in a drawer. I feel like I'm doing a terrible job right now. Checking they didn't have a another side to them. Can't do that yet.
Okay, we've got batteries, a cassette tape, and half of an X. And a door that we cannot get through, and another lock which has a code. Oh, and another box that requires a little key. There's that peacock again. We found the top half of the axe. <laughs> guess now we can go and get into that was just a case of me not looking properly and it makes a lot of sense that the axe would be in the wood
bolt cutters. Oh! Damn it. <laughs> okay, now we've got places we can go. And and hopefully not people we can see. Actually, I'm not sure if seeing people would be better than not seeing the people. But that's not the point. Snip, snip. The light shines in the darkness and the darkness has not overcome it. We found the first cassette. Okay, and now there was that room upstairs. I didn't see anything else in there. That was... I don't want to say it would be of any use, because I don't feel that's the, the case. There's lots of things that would be of use if we were allowed to pick them up. But even... Satan disguises himself as an angel of light. A button two of a keypad. Okay, page 11. Highway 66, October 6, 2003. Car accident leaves woman dead, man in coma. A tragic ac car accident on Highway 66 has claimed the life of a woman who left a who, and left a man in a coma. The couple's car reportedly swerved off the road around 23.30 and hit a tree, resulting in the woman's death at the scene and the man being rushed to hospital with severe injuries. The cause of the accident is still under investigation, and the families and friends of the individuals involved are left mourning and praying for the recovery of the survivor. Our thoughts are with them during this difficult time. Crystal orb delicately adorned with intricate patterns, and it looks really shiny. It does look really shiny. Oh, there's a present. Page four of 20. My wife and kids went out of town for a few days, so I'm home alone in the house. I keep hearing strange noises and seeing things out of the corner of my eye. I don't know how much longer I can take this. This is like the second one of these jars that we've seen. And I think they look cool. Okay, let's chop these down because we can. It's 
So the numbers were 20 with with that. That was the time on the article. And I knew I recognized the numbers cuz I it was on here. I wonder Ooh, that's kind of freaky. Can we hit it? Probably best not to hit it. We might- oh. I've been waiting for you. That wasn't there before, was it? I feel like I would have noticed that before, if it had been the case. I wonder if we can change the clock. Well, that's what time it is on the clock as well. Oh, it's also, th yeah, it's also there. So that number combination means something, but I'm just not sure what at this stage. Unless it's I'm gonna try. I'm just gonna. Oh, I'm gonna make this 11. back to the other locked bit and see if there's something else that we missed.
wooden box key. And this is why I check in all of the drawers. Did you forget, Robert? No. Oh, the cross is upside down now as well. And so you're like, I, I don't know what, what did I, what might I have forgotten? There's a lot going on in my life right now. I, I can't be on top of everything. Box is upstairs. In case I forgot, the lock combination is my birthday. 1956. Forgot already? Okay. 1956. This way. One, nine, five, six. Basement key. Progress. If only I'd looked properly the first time. Um, what is this? I don't think I have anything for that. Page three of twenty. I keep having nightmares about a creature with red eyes and giant wings. I can't sleep anymore. Every time I close my eyes, I see it. I can't shake the feeling that it's watching me. I feel like it's trying to consume me, body and soul. <gasps> We've got a cassette player. Wooden rosary. A sacred prayer tool adorned with symbolic beads. The rosary brings peace and spiritual connection through medica meditation and reflection. It says John on it. All right, let's use the cassette player and we'll play this one first. It started with strange noises at night, like something was scratching at the windows. I thought it was just my imagination, but then I saw it. It was watching me from the trees like it was waiting for something. I did some research and found out that it's been sighted in this area before. People say that it's a harbinger of doom and that it shows up before something bad happens. It's been like this for hundreds of years. The name Mothman keeps coming up. I feel like I'm losing my mind. Okay. And we've got... Yesterday, the... late at night, I found my son standing at the window, talking to someone or something. When I asked him who he was talking to, he said he didn't remember, but all he knew was that he wanted to go in the backyard. My wife says that she saw it too outside the front entrance, watching her through the window, calling her to come out. I'm starting to think that this thing is trying to lure my family outside. I don't know how I can protect them. I'll start documenting everything in my journal too, just in case something happens. All right. An old 1920s camera, its brass and leather exterior shows signs of wear and tear. So something goes on that. 
I saw one like that before. But it wouldn't let me pick it up. But I believe now we have the key to the door down here. Ta-da! And I guess we're going to go and explore the basement. <laughs>